this first half. 15 of a 19 for 205 yards, not too bad. Back shoulder throw, a little push off, and Malik Heath executed it perfectly. Sticking him in man coverage. Screen out to the edge. Jaden Wally. It's across the midfield stripe before he's turned back. Picked up four. Balance, and that changed the way defenses had to play them the last two weeks. It's just been absent. And no balance today. As Will Rogers about to put it up for the 33rd time in the game. The rush breathing down his neck, but he is able to outlet to J.J. Jernigan for a first down, a gain of 15. Rogers taking a shot. Incomplete for Makai Polk, but flags out. Polk got held as he got to about the 15, maybe close to the 10-yard line. Nehemiah Pritchett. Looks like reached out and grabbed him in eight quarters. And they're looking to go back to back here. Play action for Will Rogers. As all day, finds a little check down to Dylan Johnson. Speed to the sideline, and Dylan Johnson steps out of bounds. Near the 10 yard line, he picks up nine on first down. Did call that one a running play, only the seventh running play of the day so far for Mississippi State. Here goes Woody Marks in motion. A slant at the goal line, reaching back. Jameer Calvin holds on for the touchdown. Interesting, this football game with this possession. Mississippi State starting at their two-yard line. Rodgers out of the end zone. Gets it to the sideline. Jaden Wally makes a man miss, and he's got nine yards. A huge play. That, that always, as a quarterback, as a coach, makes you nervous back up against your... Rodgers, incomplete. Makai Polk looking for a flag, and there it is. That ball is tipped as they try the wide receiver screen. To Kobe McLean. Again, they show blitz. Here comes Tennyson off the edge. They pick it up. And a contested catch is made. Short of the first down line to gain by Jaden Wally. Blitz. And there goes Woody Marks emptying the backfield. Rodgers over the middle. In stride, he's got Ra Ra Thomas. Big third down conversion for Mississippi State after that. Rodgers over the middle. Kai Polk. And on the big Auburn logo for about six. Tried to watch games whenever they were coached by Mike Leach to learn the system. And there's a little throwback screen to Jameer Calvin. He's going to lose yards, though. So, Auburn's brought pressure the last few third downs. Looks like they're going to play coverage here. They're sneaking up, play clock at one. They get the play off. Rodgers well protected. Another shot over the middle. Malik Heath, a catch and run for a first down and more. All the way down to the 22-yard line of Auburn. 32 yards. Back-to-back -back third down conversions. Yeah, it was really the clean pocket, right? Auburn just rushes three. Will Rogers able to step up. The catch, and a great job by Heath there. Pump fake. Rogers checks it down. Dylan Johnson wide open. He's inside the 10. Hurdles down to about the four. First and goal, Mississippi State at the three. Rogers looked at his check down. Now he's looking at the end zone, dumps it off, front pylon, Dylan Johnson, he's got a Mississippi State touchdown. What did Mike Leach say early on? Just execute, they can't stop us. But look at the time that Will Rogers has. Buys time, buys time. Whoever would have seen this coming. Rogers, quick hitter. Breaking tackles is Wally. He's got a first down. I'll tell you who. The Pirate himself. Quarter. A three-man rush. All day to throw for Will Rogers. And he finds Austin Williams. First down to the 42-yard line of Auburn. In the fourth quarter, if he can get back out there. But right now, this offense is rolling. Will Rogers. Jump ball to the sideline. And the 50-50 ball is 
one by Malik Heath. It's another first down, 17, 18 more for Mississippi State. Let me tell you the difficulty of this throw, a back shoulder throw from the opposite sideline. That is so hard to execute. But Will Rogers put it right on the money. And that should take us and Will to the end of the third quarter. Boy, Mississippi State ran up this play action. Slant incomplete. Intended for Malik Keith. And Chris Buck is down there. As a flag comes out, let's check the penalty marker first. And then Chris has down by penalty to the 15-yard line for Mississippi State. Rodgers, quick toss to Woody Marks. And he's wrestled down. at seven. Second down and five. Blitz off the edge. Back the other way to Austin Williams. Rodgers in the end zone and is good for a touchdown. Makai Polk has given Mississippi State the lead. This is the exact same play, the last touchdown Makai Polk caught. They motion the outside receiver in. Red hot Mississippi State offense with their best field position of the day. And Rodgers, another hookup to Makai Polk. Another first down as they pick up right where they left off. I'll tell you what, it's just been two different ball games from really the last offensive possession that Mississippi State had in the first half to now. It's night and day, and really it's been, there's been no pressure on Will Rogers. Right? He has all day to look left, look. Rogers at the goal line, walking into the end zone, Jameer Calvin with another Mississippi State touchdown. Can get a stop as Mississippi State starts in plus territory. Rodgers, he's going to take a shot on first down, right between the hash marks. He's got Jaden Wally and right back into the red zone for the Bulldogs. I mean, at some point, you, you really got to adjust the scheme on defense, right? You're going three down rush, eight drop in defense. But when you're not getting pressure on Will Rogers, he's waiting, waiting, waiting. And he's been so accurate with the football. Watch this. Look at this pocket he's working with. So Moultrie out, play clock down to two. Rodgers takes the snap into the end zone. Touchdown to Malik Heath. And that's just going to make the crowd here at Auburn that much angrier. As with 5.31 to go, Mississippi State, an extraordinary comeback. They extend their lead. Yeah, though, right? I mean, Coach Harson, I think, was obviously stating, I don't think we can stop them continually. So Wheel route he... on third down, broken up, intended for. Woody Marks, and that actually, for the incompletion, yep. saves 40 seconds for Auburn. Now what do you do with the kicking game and the uncertainty of that? 